hello YouTube welcome back to my video in this video I am going to show you how you can solve uh, the Facebook login error uh, as uh, as shown here can't load the URL the domain e of uh, this URL isn't included in the app domain okay so basically when you are tra trying to uh, run your project in a local host or, or in any domain uh, the the Facebook login project or any other Facebook app ID project sometimes the error would come okay so all you have to do is uh, you have to add the uh, URL or of uh, your domain in the Facebook app configuration uh, section okay so I'll show you how you can do this so uh, this uh, I'll show you how when uh, this error came in my project I was trying to get uh, the Facebook login code from the Facebook developer site so first I'll show you that one so so uh, this is the full code example for uh, the Facebook uh, login uh, code so you can see here so I have just uh, copied all this code to my uh, Java project in my Eclipse ID so this is the same project I mean uh, this is the same code which you can use for uh, PHP or any other HTML supported projects okay so I have just used this one in my uh, uh, Java project so this is my Eclipse ID here where I have just pasted all the code same code here and uh, I have to create a Facebook app ID so I have just created a Facebook app so this is my Facebook app to create a Facebook app just search for uh, create a Facebook app ID in Google and it's a simple step you can create uh, the Facebook app and I have just copied this Facebook app ID in my app ID section here and I just run it in my uh, local server okay so once I run this uh, I'll get uh, I got uh, this page you can see here it's uh, currently running and uh, if I'm just clicking login here I'm getting an error can't load the URL okay so we'll uh, try to fix this error this error is coming because uh, this uh, this link uh, or this website so this is local host here now so this website is not currently registered with our app ID in uh, in the configuration settings okay now we'll try adding this one and uh, get rid of this error message okay now uh, copy the local host from here so basically this is my, our website name or our project name so if you are running this in any other project or any other website or domains just copy the complete domain uh, for example uh, if your website is www.chilifax.com just select uh, www.chilifax.com completely and come back to our uh, our app ID section or our Facebook app section where you can see here in the settings just go to the settings and in the basic setting first you have to add uh, the platform here just click on the add platform so we are going to uh, add the platform as website just click on the website and you have to give your site URL okay so our site URL what you have to give is uh, till this one okay it's a right zero slash just copy the site URL come back to uh, the uh, app uh, section just paste the site URL here and just click on save settings okay so once you save it you have to add the uh, app domain so I'm going to add as uh, localhost and uh, just press save set, set, save save changes again okay now we have added successfully our site URL and uh, the app domain also so this is the step you have what you have to follow to get rid of uh, the message which uh, we have seen now let's uh, close the error from here and let me refresh up the page from here again and uh, if I'm just clicking on login this app you can see here the error is gone and you can see here it's asking my uh, permission to get access to my profile uh, and email address okay so this is how you can uh, solve the error the uh, domain is uh, not added to the app domains okay so if you have any doubt in this uh, please comment below I'll be helping you and uh, please like and subscribe for my videos and thanks for watching